I should think you're welcome. Hey guys, what's up? It's me, Kayla, and welcome to my channel. Today's video is going to be very exciting and very interesting and very suspenseful, like all those things in one, because I am going to be seeing what is inside this suitcase right here that I have not opened up since I was probably 9 or 10. Um, I used to be really into strawberry shortcake, so that's why strawberry shortcake is on this suitcase. But I found this suitcase the other day when I was going through our attic with my mom, and I was just like, oh my gosh, like I have to make a video opening this up. Um, I can't even tell you how tempting it's been to not like look and see what's inside, but I remember always putting my favorite things in here. I cannot handle the suspense any longer, so without further ado, we are just going to get straight into this video, and I hope you guys will enjoy watching. Okay, oh, so oh, it is really heavy. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. Are you guys ready? Ah, I don't even know if I'm ready. Like, no, I certainly am. I just, I can't believe I'm actually finally doing this. All right, here we go. Oh my gosh, I'm so excited. So excited. Wait, wait, wait. I'm going to prolong the anticipation for one extra second. I want you guys to pause this video and comment below. What do you think is inside this suitcase? I'm gonna give you a second to do that. Okay, did you do it? I hope you did. I am going to take a wild guess. I think that I have either old pieces to like one of my dollhouses in here or maybe like, um, I, I don't know. I was going to say like stuffed animals because I had so many stuffed animals, but it does not feel like stuffed animals are in here. So I'm going to guess like dollhouse pieces, but I have no idea. So here we go. Let's continue. Okay. Oh my gosh. <gasps> Girl, this is so crazy. There, there's so much variety of different things in here. I, oh my gosh, wait, this is just so weird. I am feeling so nostalgic right now. Like it is hitting me hard. So all of my strawberry shortcake dolls are in here. And like I said, I used to love these. Comment below if you used to love them too. Um, some of you may be too young, but oh my gosh. I wonder if they still, no, I was going to say, I wonder if they still smell good. Uh, no, it literally smells like a dead person's attic. What is this? This is not a strawberry shortcake. It's a tin man. Oh my gosh, this is so crazy, guys. Ah, I thought that my hair was their hair, so I'm like, uh. Not only are there strawberry shortcake dolls in here, but there's something in, like, this bag right here that I, I'm going to go through in a second. I just, oh my gosh, wait, hang on, there's a baggie. Oh, these were my favorite strawberry shortcake dolls. I like the little ones the best. This was ginger snap, cake, um, orange blossom, and poor strawberry shortcake. I used to change her hair all the time. So she was bald and then I missed her hair. So I glued pigtails onto her head. Uh, wow, I feel so bad for her. She was always my favorite though. And I also liked cake. Yeah. Oh, even those smell like a dead person's attic, unfortunately. Wow. Okay, I want to see what's inside this little pouch. I mean, there are so many strawberry shortcake dolls. It's insane. Um, but let's see what's in here. I feel bouncy balls. I feel bouncy balls. Oh, my gosh. Girl. Oh, my gosh. There's bouncy balls in here and silly bands. This suitcase is pretty much like a suitcase full of my old collections. Like, I didn't always collect just lip balms and pocket backs. I used to collect all of these things too. Silly bands were everything. Who remembers silly bands? This is just, oh my gosh, so much nostalgia. I can't even. Wow. Oh my gosh, an unopened pack. This is a Toy Story pack. I cannot even, like, begin to express to you the amount of joy I would feel getting a new silly band. Because I remember, like, all my friends at school had them, and I always thought, like, oh my gosh, those are so cool. I want one. And I remember just getting one. Somebody gave me one, and I thought I was so cool. And then the obsession just grew and grew and grew. I remember me and my friends would sit and trade these during recess. <gasps> so many memories. That is just, a oh, memory lane. That's all I can say. What else? So... Oh my gosh, my bouncy ball collection. I used to have more of these, but I actually remember giving like more than half to my cousin Hayden because I went through a phase where I was like over them, um, but then I got back into them again. Wait, dude, that's so weird. Oh my gosh. So some of these are like, they're very rough feeling because they're so old. Look, can you tell? 
that is just crazy. I remember I used to be obsessed with like all the different patterns. That's why I liked them so much because no two were exactly the same. Um, I'm going to see if I can find my favorite. I remember my favorite was like clear and it had stars in it. I don't know if I still have it. Um, oh wait, this is it I think. Hang on, I think I might have found it. No, it's, that's not it. But I used to love the clear ones with like different things inside. Oh my gosh, look guys. Ah, that's so cool. Crazy 8 bouncy ball. I don't know how interesting this is for you guys to watch, but for me it's just like, this is so neat. Ah, bouncy balls galore. I remember I used to take all of them and I would dump them into my bathtub so they'd be all contained in one space, but they'd all bounce super high and it would be the coolest thing ever. I might even have a video of me doing that on my old iPod. If I do, I'll insert the clip here. Yeah. Anyways, um, what else is in here? Oh, wait, okay, so at the bottom of the bag, there are four, this is, oh my gosh, this is so crazy. There are four letters and, okay, so guys, fun fact, whenever I was younger, I always aspired to be a mailman because I used to think that the mailman got to write letters to people, put them in envelopes, and then deliver them. Like, that's how I thought it worked. So I used to play mailman. And, oh my gosh, we should open one. So I, I would literally, like, I don't know what I did. If I would color pictures or what, but I'd put them in envelopes and I'd, like, make a collection of them and pretend to deliver them. Um, let's open this one because it's kind of thick and I like the thick envelopes. This is crazy. By the way, the front just, I wrote Kayla with a stamp. Oh, lined paper. Seriously. It's literally just a letter J. Well, that's kind of boring. No offense. Yeah, I remember I used to get lazy, and eventually I would just write, like, random letters or random numbers on a piece of paper because I didn't feel like, you know, doing much. We're going to open this one. It says Kayla Andrew, my full name. I feel bad just, like, ripping into these, but I want to see if this one's any better than the last one because, yeah. Um, aw, that's cute. It just says winter, and I drew, like, a little snowman and snowflakes. I'm not going to open the other two. But, um, yeah, that's pretty neat. Anyway, what else is in here? Oh, it's a little hat. I bet this would look stunning on me. No, you know who this would look great on? This would look great on my bird, Lucky. She's gonna hate me for this. Hey, Lucky! Lucky Charms! Do you wanna try on a hat? You wanna be a fashionista? No comment from her. I'm gonna go get her out of her cage. She's gonna look amazing in this, I, I promise. You smell like maple syrup today. All right, you wanna try this hat on? Oh, she looks a little unsure. It'll match your feathers and your body. Whoa, it's okay. Look, ready? Oh, she didn't like it. <laughs> she just flung it off her head. I think there's other hats in here, Lucky. It's okay. Oh, a Santa Claus hat. Lucky, I've been trying to find this for you. Oh my gosh, I was literally gonna order her one. Here comes Santa Claus, here comes Santa Claus. I can't. Christmas without you. Do you like Santa Claus? Say yes. You like Santa Claus, yeah. She's a little baby. She's just a little baby. Love you. Mwah. Thank you for being a good sport. You're the best bird in the whole world. Okay, I'm gonna go put her back now. That was a doozy. Let's see, is there anything else in here? Um, 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 um oh, it's a little baby. Aww. Oh, OMG! More of my childhood. More little bits of my childhood. This is just so crazy. So I used to collect these things called squishies. Like, I had actually, like, thousands of them. I had, like, 16,000 at the end. Um, oh, wow. So there's squishies and these little things called squinkies. 
um, they were different. There were always videos people would post on YouTube like Squinkies versus Squishies because Squishies came first and then everybody thought that Squinkies copied Squishies. But anyway, um, I used to be obsessed with these. That is so fun. Um, and I think there's like one more little bag in here. Let's open this up. I'm not sure what's in it. Oh, this is neat. So whenever I was younger, me and my brother used to make these custom squishies. So like we would make them rare and we would like paint them and do different things with them. That's actually really neat. This snake that I did. Um, here's like a little frog. I don't know who did what, but I know Scotty used to do these with me. Scott probably did that one. That one's kind of weird. Koala. This is just so fun. I, wow, I feel like so alive right now. It just brought back like a rush of all these memories. I'm trying to see if there's anything else interesting. Oh my gosh, it's a fake fortune cookie. Oh, that's so cool. I am going to be making fortune cookie lip tests. So I'm going to put this aside and it could be like part of the picture. Wow, we. That was so much fun. But okay, you guys, so that was all for today's video. If you enjoyed it, please don't forget to give it a big thumbs up. And if you'd like me to do more videos like this in the future where I find like old bags or boxes or whatever and I go through it with you guys, definitely let me know because I'm sure if I looked hard enough, I could find more. Um, also, the question of the day is, what was one type of toy that you really enjoyed playing with as a kid? Did you like strawberry shortcake dolls like me? Or was there something else that you really liked? I would love to hear from you guys, so make sure you let me know in the comment section below. But I love you all so, so much. Thank you again for watching this video, and I'll talk to you soon. Bye!